work there? And you're like, <laughs> yeah. You need dance. Making, Uni universal dance. Making a video about shift to detent kit. It's going to be sweet. Shift to detent kit. What, what? Shift to detent kit. Come on, Jeff. Shift to detent kit. What, what? <laughs> All right. <laughs> now are we ready? <laughs> yeah. Did you need to do a little dance or anything? No, no, no. no. <laughs> All right. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Jeff and I are here with you today once again. No, it's been a while, but we're here with some exciting news. We are here to announce the recent release of our shifter detent kit for 22 plus WX STI and older models, right? Pretty much all the models except for five speeds. Okay, well, I apologize to you five speed guys out there. We know it's the go to transmission. It will be coming. It will be coming. Anywho, uh, so these are a bunch of the little pieces um, that you get with the shifter detent kit. Uh, they are gonna give you a little bit better shift feel uh, from your shifts and whatnot. Very similar to our shifter stop, or if you've bought one recently or got the upgrade kit, you might know it as the super shifter stop. Really uh, reducing the slop of your vertical and horizontal shift slop. So this is gonna be in the same boat, but I will let Jeff dive into a little bit more technical specifications because I do know there's just a little bit more to it than that. Yeah, so the shifter detent kit is similar to the shifter stop and that it improves the shifter feel, but it does it a different way by putting more pressure on the little tiny ball that's inside of the shift or inside of your transmission that moves along the shift rods as you shift. The shifter detent kit puts more pressure on the spring, so it makes for more positive shifts. So every time you put it into gear, it's more of a pop into that gear. Even going into neutral, it's more of a pop. Um, Nice. And it, it adds another kind of positive feel to the shifter, just like the shifter stop does. Um, and I, yeah, that's really it. Um, we, on the smaller size ones, have an O-ring fitting on it. So you get rid of the crush washer that sometimes has to be replaced. Mm. Um, Super says you should replace it every time, but now we have an O-ring on it. So that's a little small bonus that you don't need to do that. Cool. And that's what that little groove inside there is for, I would take it. Yep. Perfect. Um, and they're really easy to put on. There's one tricky one on every transmission, but uh, within an hour of work, you can have this. And uh, all of our test customers have said that it's like a wow improvement. So. Great. Well, I mean, that was going to be my next question. Everybody always likes to know the difficulty of installation and whatnot. Um, I know the super shifter stops a pretty simple one to install. Of course, you have the luxury of being inside the car when you do that. Um, I know these are going to require you to get underneath your car, get a little cramped and uncomfortable, but other than that, relatively easy install. Pretty easy. Yeah. No real special tools. Um, but you do got to help. You have to get under your car. So, cool. Yeah. Uh, as far as, you know, we've made the comparison to the, the super shifter stop, or again, if you guys just have the, the shift stop, get that upgrade kit. You're it's going to make a big difference. You'll appreciate that one. But um, putting these together the um, the shifter stop and the detent kit I mean the improvement on a scale of one to ten what are we what are we looking at there that's a pretty great improvement I would throw in our shifter bushing for those cars as well mm -hmm. and that will I'd say those three part numbers together would make for a massive change in how the car feels okay uh, much more solid shifts yeah and uh, that applies to the six-speed STIs, which have a different shifter bushing than the ones that use the oh, shifter cool. stop. But, um, but yeah, I think sometimes a worry when making your shifter more stiff, um, you're gonna have any sort of issues with getting it into gear. Or yeah, this is way less force than like a really really short uh, short throw shifter. Okay, um, we've tested some people that have the short throw shifters in the cars, and they find the same improvement, and it's not too difficult. So awesome. It, sh it should be great. So uh, everything you get in the box, we'll show you a close up here to show you all the little bits and pieces because we know they're a little tiny here. Um, but you are going to get uh, multiple little uh, shift detents in there. 
or what would you consider these bolts, I guess you could yeah, say? Yeah, I call them shift detent bolt. Okay, yeah. so you'll get a few of those in the box to go inside the, they go up along like the transmission. Right? Yep, on the side of the transmission, you'll see them over there. Okay, cool. So we'll show you what's in the box there. So with the shift detent kit and the combination of the shifter stop, I know, I'm not sure if this video has reached you guys before our clutch delay delete, but is that another part that we are releasing that is going to kind of tie into the ecosystem of all this stuff? Yeah, definitely. The clutch delay delete valve uh, is another great part to add to it. It adds a much more natural clutch feel. Um, Gets, it makes the release of it more consistent. And again, having to do with the shifting, that all ties in together and just adds another level of uh, making the shifter feel better. Cool. Well, everybody, um, unfortunately, at least here in the Pacific Northwest, summer has come to a close. Uh, we still got some nice weather, but we know that the rain is right around the corner. So now's the best time to, if. If you don't have any of these, of course, the shifty tank kit, um, that's brand new. So I would assume most of you don't have them. Some of you might have the shifter stop uh, and the clutch delay delete. That's another thing that's uh, just getting released here right along with the shifter detent kit. So I'm assuming you guys don't have that either. But now is the perfect time to grab all these little parts and pieces to make your car feel so much better. Um, we're all going to be in our garages wrenching on our cars this winter. So if you guys are interested in these, if you guys have any more questions, as always, leave a comment down below. We will get back to you as soon as we can, as per usual. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, y'all know what to do.